so hello students welcome back to my channel so today in this video i am going to i am going to discuss social impact of it and the question answers so here is the question answers so number one question you have write the purpose of antivirus software so you have to write the purpose and antivirus software is used for the following purpose you have to write two purpose i have given so you just write it next you have why should the antivirus software be regularly updated so an antivirus software should be updated regularly so that it recognizes new version of malicious programs so this is question number 2 next we have question number 3 what is a trojan horse the trojan horse is a type of malicious code it may look like a helpful program but it is harmful okay but it harms our computer program when the user tries to open it what is the what is worm how is it harmful so a worm is a malicious self replicating software program popularly termed as malware it is harmful in many ways so here two ways i have given so it can run independently and travel from one computer to another through computer network and it can self replicate and lead to negative effect on our system okay so computer system may become bad so what is the use of well, sorry what is a computer virus why is it called so so a computer virus is a program that is designed to spread from one computer to another through computer network infecting the system they are also, they are called so because of their features to self replicate and to expand continuously by infecting more and more computer system okay so next is discuss the positive impact so you just write the positive impact like this i have given uh, all the positive impact i have written here and if you want to describe you can describe any two okay so in exam you can describe any two so write any five negative impact so directly i am writing the neg negative impacts the five neg negative impacts of it on society are threat to data security decrease in person to person contact new opportunities for crimes cultural invasion reduced employment opportunity and these are some extra questions which are from book from chapter so these things you will when you will study the text properly you will come to know what is cyber crime so any crime using computer and internet is termed as cyber crime what is anti spyware so anti spyware are securities software development to protect computer from spy spyware okay anti spyware like anti virus no so anti spyware and ethical hacking means what hacking which is done for a good cause such as national security etc is known as ethical hacking and what is spam so spam is an unsolicited solicited unwanted email okay so unwanted email which is in your uh, computer in your mail id no so those are called spam and next i have given some name the following so two examples of worm here the examples are written you can just read you can just note it down and any three antivirus programs that is norton quickil mcafee so here i have given uh, four so you just write three any three any three examples of malware and the last part is what is the full form of virus okay the full form of virus is you know that vital information resources under seeds so this is the full form of virus so with this the video is ending and i hope you like the video and if you like the video don't forget to cross press the like button so as you do in other videos no so and then you just uh, note it down the questions and thank you so much for watching my videos and have a wonderful day